there and welcome to another tutorial for our template JM Concilium. Um, for this tutorial I'm going to show you the different header styles that we have. So just to show you what I mean here, I'm on the um, corporate page of, of our template and you can see that, that the background image for the slideshow is, is, goes right to the top of the browser window. Um, and if I navigate to another page, if I go to the, the default home page, the creative page, you'll see that the header is actually a white uh, bar across the top so we, we give you the option of two different header styles here so we call this the transparent header so if I navigate back to the corporate page you'll see that the background image from the slideshow is again is back to the top of the, the browser window there so for you guys to take control of this uh, I'll just show you quickly here is going to the back end of the template so I'll just close where I was at and we'll start again um, so if we um, so that close there. So we go to Extensions Template Manager. So we go into the Template Manager, and then we want to um, go into the GM Concilium Corporate Template that we've created here. So if I click into that, and I'll just show you two different ways of doing this. Um, so once that page loads, and then we go into the Layout tab. And then we've got the header section here again for the layout. So if we click on the settings for the header section, you'll see here we have a custom class. So it's container, space, header on top. So all we need to do is delete the word header on top and the space. And then if we apply that and then just save that. I'll just show you what it does to the, uh, to the actual corporate page. So if I reload the corporate page, You'll see that the header actually becomes a white bar across the top. So, just wait this page to load. so you can see there the page is loading and we've got a white header here. But the logo, because the logo was white on this uh, demo page, you can't see that logo. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back in here, back to the layout tab, and I'm actually going to change that back to what it was. So I'll just put the class in there, header on the space, header on top, apply that, and save and close that. And then if we go back to the, the front page and then just refresh that page. So again waiting for it to be a little slow today. And you'll see now that the uh, background image again goes to the top of the browser window. But what I'm going to do is if I navigate to the home and create a parallax page. And you'll see here that we have the white header across the top. So if I then go into the creative parallax template in the back end of the website and again click on the layout tab and we go to the settings for that tab uh, for the for the header section within this template and if we just put space header on top apply that click the save button and again wait for the internet and then if we go to the front end of the website refresh that page so there you can see the actual background image at the top of the window. So if we scroll down, you can see that parallax effect goes to the top of the background image with the menu. So just another another feature within the, the Joomla Man template. So again, I'm just going to go back and change this because we don't want to leave the demo like that. So just delete that there, apply, save and close. And then if we go to the front end of the website, refresh this page again you'll see that the white header comes back so and there you can see the white header is back so again the feature that I've just discussed with you so if you have any questions uh, and want to get in touch with us for any support on this template so just go to the Joomla Man support forum or use this the ticket system within our website and uh, our support team will be more than happy to help so thank you very much